Welcome to the shop. Hope you're having a great day. Woo, I'm going to it. Alright, man, this thing has been warped back and forth. I pushed it too far one time and not far enough. And I'm just going to put it on the surface grinder. I got it pretty straight, but, you know, there's a little bit of a warp in it. So hopefully we get it straight. Yeah, then I got these four all perfectly straight. This one... Which one? This one was a little out, but it's good. I'll make sure to put my website up in the cards. First down description, I got knives on there, shirts on there, Amazon links, all the tools I use, stuff like that. And uh, do me a favor, leave me some comments. Let me know where your knife making's going, if you progressed, or if you need any help, questions, any of that stuff. Like, subscribe, hit the bell. Let's just get to the service grinder. Woo! So it touches right there and it does it there. Come on to bring it down just a little bit. Not too much and flip over and do the same. Wish me luck. That wasn't too bad. One down, four to go. 52 100, let's do it. Alright, 120's gonna be the same thing, so uh, I'll meet you at the grinder when I'm finished. Here we go, 14 inch wheel. Now check this out. It's hanging down lower. I had to cut this much off just to get it to fit on the small one, but you know, now we got more clearance and all that. It's still pretty tight, but that's alright. <laughs> Even the thing right here is like touching almost. Just a little bit of clearance. <laughs> I guess I could move that back if I had to, but uh, well, no. Cause anyway, I digress. Let's get to it. I already did this side for Instagram. Well, I started this side for Instagram, but uh, yeah. So, man, I had to do so much straightening and taking so much off of one side and then the other that my center line shifted to this side that's why i did this side for instagram because it was just you know barely touching it we're right on the line i gotta take a whole bunch off this side now if i would have made a thinner center i'd have to grind this uh smaller just to have a thicker line so anyway yeah that's why i keep well that and warping you don't want it thin you know i see a lot of guys before heat treat put like one line then they go real small and it's like man chances of warping are worse all right let me finish out this side let me mark it finish out that side and then we'll see where we get it is like 2 a.m so <laughs> and mom today is my mom's 91st birthday if you guys don't know i take care of her she had a, a paralyzing stroke five years ago so <laughs> another year i'll take it all right, let's get it. I'm rambling. Damn, I can already see the hummum popping through. <laughs> on a 50 yeah yeah man <laughs> all right the other side
it's like 2.30, something like that, a.m. <laughs> so we'll do 120 next, but woo, we pulled it off. We got it straight. Man, I got to admit I was a little worried about that. See you tomorrow. 120 on there. Uh, I, I marked here because it needs to come in this way a little bit. And a little bit here, just, just a teeny bit. Yeah, it's just a little bit off or, yeah, it just needs a little bit of straightening. But since we're at 120, I'm gonna bring this back here and I'm gonna hit it in the plunge line first. Then we'll bring it up and uh, see where we're at. I forgot how thin hollow grinds are. I had to take some off of here. <laughs> it was like already at a zero grind. So, yeah, I got it all even now. And nice and straight. I might take a little bit down. Yeah, I'll just take a little bit down like that the whole way. It's a little thin right there too. I'm gonna put some oil on this so it doesn't rust. Then we'll go to six inch. After the handles, then we'll bring it all up to the really fine stuff. Cause I gotta do handles and all that, and then we'll uh, take it up to the 1500s or whatever. Next, here we go, six inch. I messed up and I started here. This is the 50 that I used from the 14 inch. I didn't want to cut back here until I got to the 120 cause it's more forgiving. We'll see if we can fix it up. If not, I can always, uh, Hit it with the magnet on the flat and bring it up a little bit, but that's all right. It shouldn't be too bad. We should be able to get it. Yeah, so I want to stay here and just clean this out and bring it down to the line. And then put the 120 on. <laughs> Woo! It's easy to forget little things like that. Had to move my bucket sparks were all flying and hitting me. <laughs> Be, we should be able to fix that. I'm glad I stopped and caught myself. Cause man, these belts are just, you know, bigger cardboard, they're thicker, they don't, you know, they're not as smooth. All right, I went ahead and I got it. 
I got it off camera. I don't need it up to here. You know, I just tapped it in and then brought it to here. And then my minute for Instagram was over. <laughs> all right, so I'm going to tap this one in and we'll finish them all out. And then I'm calling it a night. It's like 1.30. Mom's birthday is over, so uh, another day. I'm just blessed to have her. Anyway, here we go. Built in cutting it. <laughs> Quite literally. <laughs> I must have done a good heat treat because I noticed I've been putting a lot more work into this knife, man. <laughs> Woo! Oh. oh man. Yeah, it's late. <laughs> actually <laughs> I got to get on these compound grinds but first I'm gonna record a video it should be up in a day or two maybe three days because I got a bunch of stuff on my shoulders that I got to get off a ramp video I'm thinking about maybe doing some more ramp videos and all that but uh I digress maybe some storytelling who knows so that's about it make sure to like comment subscribe hit the bell all that stuff I always tell you to do Check out my website, the so first down in the description, up in the cards. Oh, man, I'm kind of getting frustrated with YouTube and all that, but uh, that'll be in the rant. Anyway, I digress. I'll put the playlist for the rest of this build up there, and uh, my website's right there. Hope you're having a great day, and as always, take it easy.